Hello everyone, the topic we are going to discuss today is Tower of Honor. Now let us see what is Tower of Honor. Tower of Honor is a mathematical puzzle which consists of three discs or more than that and it follows certain rules to arrange these discs. Some of the basic rules are only one disc is moved, only the top disc can be moved, no large disc can sit over the small disc. Let us take a look at the picture representation of Tower of Honor. Now you can see three rods. Rod A, Rod B, Rod C. In Rod A, we have three discs. In step 1, we are moving the smallest disc from Rod A to its destination Rod C. In step 2, we are moving the second largest disc from Rod A to Rod B. We can't move it to Rod C because as per the rule, small disc should be placed above the larger disc. In step 3, we are moving the smallest disc from Rod C to Rod B. In step 4, we are moving the final largest disc from Rod A to its destination Rod C. In step 5, we are again moving the smallest disc from Rod B to Rod A. And in step 6, we are moving the second largest disc from Rod B to its destination Rod C. In the final step, we are again moving the smallest disc from Rod A to its destination Rod C. Let's get into the algorithm. Start, Procedure, Annoy, Disc comma, Source comma, Destination comma, Aux. If disc is equal to equal to 1, then move disc from source to destination. Else, three step has to be followed. Step 1, Annoy, Disc minus 1, comma, Source, comma, Aux, comma, Destination. Step 2, Move disc from source to destination. Step 3, Annoy, Disc minus 1, comma, Aux, comma, Destination, comma, Source. End if, end procedure, stop. Now let us see the algorithm in steps one by one. Step 1. Decide a parameter indicating the input size. Step 2. Identify the basic operation. The basic operation is considered as movement of one disk and, is de and it is denoted as M of N. Step 3. Check whether the number of times the basic operation is executed. Step 4. Setting up recurrence relation. M of N is equal to M of N minus 1 plus 1 plus m of n minus 1 for n greater than 1. As we see in step 1, since it is a function call, we are considering it as m of n minus 1. In step 2, there is a movement from source to destination and we are taking it as 1. In step 3, there also been a function call and we are considering it as m of n minus 1. Therefore, m of n is equal to by adding m of n minus 1 plus m of n minus 1, we get 2m of n minus 1 plus 1 for n greater than 1. Since it is a recurrence function, we are considering as m of 1 is equal to 1. Step 5. Solve the recurrence. We solve this recurrence by backward substitution. m of n is equal to 2m of n minus 1 plus 1. Consider it as the first equation. When n is equal to n minus 1, m of n minus 1 is equal to 2m of n minus 2 plus 1. Consider it as the second equation. Substitute 2 in 1. Therefore, 1 becomes m of n is equal to 2 square m of n minus 2 plus 2 plus 1. Consider it as the third equation. When n is equal to n minus 2, m of n minus 2 is equal to 2m of n minus 3 plus 1. Consider it as the fourth equation. Substitute 4 in 3 and we get m of n is equal to 2 power 2 m of n minus 3 plus 2 power 2 plus 2 plus 1. In general, m of n is equal to 2 power i m of n minus i plus 2 power i minus 1 plus 2 power i minus 2 plus 2 plus 1. Consider it as the fifth equation. Since the initial condition is specified for n minus 1, we apply the value i is equal to n minus 1 in the above formula. Since i is equal to n minus 1, fifth equation gives m of n is equal to 2 power n minus 1, m of n minus n minus 1 plus 2 power n minus 1 minus 1. We get 2 power n minus 1 into m of 1 plus 2 power n minus 1 minus 1. Since m of 1 is constant, it has been taken out. And we get 2 power n minus 1 minus 1. We are converting it approximately into 2 power n. Therefore, time complexity for tower of noise is big O of 2 power n. Thus, the mathematical analysis of regressive algorithm for Tower of Honor has been shown to you.
Thank you.